it's a bright sunny day and very very hot so I'm wearing my hat even in the woods check this out This is one of the things I learned after being in the woods for 40 years, that if you step on a sugar maple seedling, it will pop right back up and it won't be destroyed at all. Take a look at this. Great strategy. Here is another plant that's a survivor. If I step on this royal fern, it pops back up. Yes, I have my forester's eyes on, and I see this white pine with blue paint on it, telling the logger this is the one to harvest. The forester marks the base of the tree, so after it's cut, you can see the blue paint and know he or she cut the right tree. This is a recently cut tree. So what tree would have so much sap running down it after it was cut? Any guesses? Well, I'll tell you, it's a white pine. And the crystals that are hanging down at the bottom when it dried. So I'm going to end with this rock full of all sorts of different kinds of lichen, which I pass so often going through the woods. It's one that the glacier left behind not bedrock.